All right, we are gonna take a look at creating a landing page on ConvertKit, uh, offering a free digital download uh, in exchange for uh, a person's email. So this is the main ConvertKit platform on the landing page area. I'm gonna make a copy of a landing page that I've already created, offering a, uh, a digital download of a word search puzzle. So we're gonna copy this songwriting word search puzzle landing page uh, and change it over to an offer for a meditation word search puzzle. So you can create a landing page here, very simple, use a, a clean background, clean text, um, just be very clear uh, to the potential person that's going to download this what they can expect to receive. So right now we're going to change uh, just the image that they'll see on the landing page. This isn't the actual digital download yet, just the image. Um, so we'll change over the wording on here from songwriting puzzle to meditation. Uh, and that there that image uploaded there. So now we'll change the wording so this person knows what they will receive when they put in their email. Um, make sure we have this all updated, nice and bold, so they know what to expect. Um, and then we'll attach the actual PDF file uh, in a second here. But this is just the the front end, what the person will see when they enter their email. So let's go ahead, go up to settings and kind of change things on the back end. So this is the success message. This is what will pop up once they enter their email on the actual landing page. This message will pop up in green. Here's the custom domain that you can create. Um, you can have an actual URL that's kind of attached to your website or just have a unique one, um, a unique to convert kit. So we'll do that. And we'll enter the contents of the email that gets sent to them when they enter their email on the landing page. So they click claim. This email will automatically be sent to them. So we'll save that. And you can auto confirm, but they recommend not to do that. You want them to click confirm. Now we'll add the actual PDF file that will be attached to that email that gets sent. So right now it's the songwriting word search. We're going to add the meditation word search. So that's uploaded, updated. We'll get that loaded up. We'll save that. And then we'll check the advanced settings. So this is what happens next after they click claim download. Um, and then here's some of the SEO and analytics. So if so anyone were to search free meditation word search, um, this in increases your chances of um, of your posting popping up on Google or you know other analytic search engines. So we'll go ahead and save that. And let's take a preview of what the landing page will look like. So there you go, very clean, very simple. Um, they'll know what to expect. So now uh, we'll update the actual posting and save and publish. So once it's saved and published, you should be good to go to share. So you can copy a link or share on Facebook and Twitter. We're gonna copy the link and actually enter that to see what it looks like. Just confirm that it's good on the web, looks good. <clears throat> so that's good to go. Now we're gonna take a look at um, making a pin. So I'm on Canva here, and we're going to make just a short, moving graphic pin offering free word search, uh, meditation word search puzzle. So that looks good. We'll download that. You can publish directly to Pinterest, but I actually like to download it first and then go um, upload it myself on Pinterest. So here we are on my uh, our Fresh Hobby Pinterest page. We'll create a pin and upload that pin that we just created over on Canva. And go ahead, type in what you're offering. So free meditation word search puzzle. Tell a little bit about the pin. Um, you know, check out our popular word search, meditation word search page. Um, you can add alt text as well if you want. And then you can also add some tags. So that'll be things that uh, people could potentially search on Pinterest that'll improve your SEO and your uh, search results. So I just like word search, meditation, um, worksheets, something like that. And then here at the bottom, you are going to add the link that you just copied over from ConvertKit. So this is the unique link that you just made, the link to your landing page where they will enter their email. So it looks good. We're going to add this to the worksheets board that we have on our Pinterest page. Everything looks good. Um, so we can go ahead and publish that. 
Looking good. So let's see the pin, make sure, just confirm everything works along the way. You want to make sure that as you're doing this, you're not making any mistakes, overlooking anything. So the pin looks good. We have the unique link. Um, so we can click that. Just, you know, like I said, double check everything works. So there we go. Download our free meditation word search puzzle. Enter the email. Again, I'm going to even test this. I'm going to put in my own email, make sure that this works. There's the success message. I'm going to go over and check my email to make sure that the digital download came through and that everything is working. So this is the acceptance email. Click claim my free download. We'll see if it came through. Perfect. So that's the PDF file that we attached there for your customer. Um, I know I went through this kind of fast. If you guys have questions, leave them in the comments. I'll do my best to get to that. Um, hopefully this was helpful. I know I went through it fast, but good luck. Thanks.